Hello, everyone, and good morning again. Thank you for joining our webinar this morning, JIRA Service Desk for IT Service Management. Uh, we will be recording this webinar, and we'll email you a link to that recording over the next few days. The email will also include a link to register for our next webinar. As you have questions, be sure to type those in the questions box of the GoToWebinar control panel. We'll get those queued up, and we will try our best to answer all of them towards the end of this session. On the webinar today from Precipio Consulting, we have consultant Sam Bezozzi. Sam has lots of experience helping teams use Jira Service Desk for IT service management, so we're very excited to have his expertise and leadership on the webinar today. Uh, and then I'm Evan Perkins. I'm a sales consultant here at Precipio Consulting, and I'll be serving as your moderator this morning. A little bit about Precipio Consulting. We've been at Lassian Expert Partners for over six years now and are one of five platinum enterprise experts in the country. Over 99% of our projects are Atlassian related, and we've helped uh, hundreds of clients across the globe, ranging in size from 20 person companies to Fortune 20 enterprises, spanning many different industries. We help our clients with process centric technology solutions that facilitate traditional business process management, IT service management based on idle, and software development life cycles. In the SDLC space, we're helping clients transition from traditional waterfall to the agile methodology. So, whatever widgets you produce, we help improve the quality and throughput at the lowest cost. We support our clients in all facets of the Atlassian product suite and build methodologies and solutions across the entire product line. So we can help with solutions architecting and implementations, licensing, upgrades and maintenance, managed hosting, managed services, integrations, add-on development, uh, and also training. And with that, I'd like to turn things over to Sam. Thanks, Evan. Again, my name is Samuel Bezozzi, and I'm a consultant here at Precipio Consulting. I'm also a certified Scrum Master with a background in Process Engineering, Lean, and Six Sigma. This is the second webinar in a three-part series highlighting the outstanding functionality that every team can experience with Jira Service Desk. We'll start with a discussion around the base functionality that JSD brings to the table and some principles of ITSM. Then we'll go through an example showing how Jira Service Desk is generally used. We'll look at advanced functionality and ways to take your team's performance to the next level. And finally, we'll go through a use case that we at Precipio Consulting have helped a client implement. But first, I'm happy to welcome Paul Buffington, Principal Product Marketing Manager of Jira Service Desk at Atlassian, to talk a little about the tool and what to expect in future releases. Paul, thanks so much for coming today. Thanks, Sam, and good day to everyone from our San Francisco office here at Atlassian. My name is Paul Buffington, as Sam mentioned, and I'll just give you a little bit of background on myself. I joined the team just about a year ago, and I come from an ITSM consulting background, about 15 years in the space. I love working with Atlassian, what the products can do around Teams, and especially Jira Service Desk. And so what I want to do is just take a few minutes and talk about how it helps IT teams solve many of the challenges that they face today. Sam will look at a lot of the details and use cases. I'm going to actually focus on just a high level big picture of the fit as well as how it fits with some of the other products. And I want to highlight some of the most uh, recent features that our, the engineering team has been working very hard on uh, to release. So let's get started. Now we're very familiar with the challenges that IT teams face and they actually come from multiple perspectives. But you think about your teams today. Um, around IT support. At the end of the day, it's around delivering great service, both on the business side as well as the technical services that keep everything up and running. Now, this comes from a couple different perspectives, and that is from the business side, they have a demand for new services, uh, being able to easily request for help, uh, new services that they want online to make their jobs easier. And they also just, they want simple way of asking for help from IT. And on the other side of this, IT sits between two groups. The other group that they're often focused on are the developers within their organization. They want a better alignment with IT. So when there's an outage or there's an issue, they want to know potentially is that aligned with a, a software bug that maybe there is in their backlog. And there's a lack of visibility. And so they want to improve that visibility. 
Now, I want to talk about where Jira Service Desk has come from in its evolution, and it comes right out of our Jira customers. In fact, there were over 40% of Jira teams using Jira at, from, for an IT function. And that was just over two years ago that we actually developed and released Jira Service Desk. So it's evolved directly out of that need. And oftentimes, it is IT teams that are supporting software teams. Now, the great thing of this with the most recent release of Jira 7 and Jira Service Desk 3 is that they're all on one platform. That means these teams can work very closely together, especially as IT is starting to cross over and align itself to teams that are agile using DevOps approach to software development. 